look who it is! It's Salt! She's okay! I just got some of the greatest news ever! And I'm not going to do a super long click about it because I do have to work. But I just got a call. I am getting my script back. I'm getting it back two years early with no, there's no payment. There's nothing. I don't have to be paid. I don't have to pay anything. I just need to, we just need to send over a contract for them to sign agreeing to give it back to me. But I got a call from the person who was going to be the director, but isn't at that company anymore. But he was the one who had reached out to the main person of the company saying, hey, if you guys aren't going to do anything would you agree to give it back? And he just called me to say, yes, he fought, he like, not finally agreed, but finally they got to have that discussion. And, you know, he said, yeah, we'll give it back to her free of charge. Yes! That huge, amazing thing happening means that I think there is no way I am winning that award tomorrow night, which is totally fine. I just, I cannot imagine the universe doing two doing another awesome thing after this incredible thing like that is a win like like this is the win this is the win of the weekend being able to get it back is huge i'm so excited it's honestly kind of easier to look at it that way because um speaking of that too did i already say i don't think i did i reached out to the instagram page for the festival because i was like hey guys um what's the dress code for tomorrow also i'm waiting for my food to heat up I was like, what's the dress code for tomorrow? And I'm so glad I asked because they said semi-formal to formal, whichever one of those you want to do. And I was like, I'm so glad I asked because I thought they were going to say business casual. Anyway, um, so this is the one thing though. It's like being nominated for something like this is amazing, but it's so Ah, like being in person for it is so stressful because it's like, I, when people say, well, it's an honor to be nominated, that's 100% true. That is 110% true. But most people are like, man, I really would love to win insert thing here, whatever it is. And that's exactly how I am. Wow, it would be really incredible to win this award tomorrow. Is it the end of the world? If it doesn't, absolutely not. It's completely fine. It is an honor to be nominated. But when you're in person, like, like, like you're, like, you are in front of people. And, like, just, too, when I was watching the Schuler Awards the other night, like, they had a camera on those people. Like, I can't, like, I, like, that amount of stress to, like, try to school your, like, emotions, you know? Because, of course, you're going to be happy, for whoever wins it, but you're also gonna feel that sense of, you know, oh man, like I'm a bit, I'm a bit bummed because you didn't, especially when it comes to something like this and it's like for acting or whatever. So um, I can't find anything on the other films that are up or the other actors from the other films. The only one I could find is I could find one review of one of the other films and it mainly talked about the director and it talked about like the use of cinematography and it mentioned one line about the actors. And it was like both actors could flip back and forth between emotion or not emotions, but personalities really well. And that was it. That's all they said. So I was like, man, I can't see them. Like I can't, like I have no idea. So it's just ah. point being though, it is easier than for me to look at this amazing thing that happened today and be like, you know what? I don't think two amazing things like that can happen in one weekend. So this is the one. The other one will, you know, not happen and that's completely fine. Because in all in all, the one that happened today is everything. That is everything. That is so, so okay. important. So the rewrite is officially done. I read over it all and I've sent it off to Emmy and AJ. Um... So yeah, um, now I'm trying to figure out what the heck I'm gonna wear. Oh, I was gonna try one heatless curling method. I think I'm gonna try another one. Well, this is about how it's supposed to look. Cause I don't own a curling iron. I don't own a straightener. I don't own any of those things because I don't really like using heat on my hair. But more than that, I would burn myself. And I know that for a fact. Unfortunately, I don't have anyone who I can call to be like hey 
want to come do my hair while I work? I don't know. And it, even so, it's not, not to say it's not that important, but to like do, I don't know. Anyway, um, but yes, I'm heading to bed. So thank you so much for watching. Hope you enjoyed. Um, social media is in the description. Love you all.